राम राम वेलकम टू द वाई स्टोरीज टुडे संडे व्हिच मींस संडे स्पेशल स्टोरी टाइम माय नेम इज युवरागी एंड हियर यू गेट टू लिसन टू इंटरेस्टिंग स्टोरीज फ्रॉम आवर चाइल्डहुड स्पेशली फ्रॉम राजस्थान टुडे स्टोरी इज कॉल्ड द स्टैच्यू स्टोरी इट्स वेरी वेरी एंशिएंट एंड आई होप यू एंजॉय बिकॉज़ देयर इज सम मैजिक इन इट वंस अपॉन अ टाइम देयर वर फोर फ्रेंड्स अ कारपेंटर अ टेलर अ गोल्डस्मिथ एंड अ प्रीस्ट they decide to go to the city in search of work on the way it becomes dark and they take rest near a well now they have precious gold and other items on them so they decide to take turns to guard through the night the first one on guard duty is a carpenter now he is finding it so difficult to stay awake he is exhausted with all the walking through the day so he looks around and he finds a log of wood he takes out his equipment and starts to carve and chisel and by the end of his turn there is a beautiful wooden statue life size wooden statue of a girl standing there next on duty is the tailor and he looks at the statue and says wow what a statue and he decides to make clothes for her third one on duty is the goldsmith and he says mwah what a statue and he decides to make jewelry for her he starts with the rakhdi the earrings the necklace the bangles the anklets and the toe rings and he makes the statue wear them all oh she looked stunning only if she was alive and the last one to on uh, take the guard duty is the priest and the priest with his knowledge exudes life into the statue and the statue comes alive there's a beautiful girl standing there well all of them starts to squabble and fight the carpenter says she belongs to me the tailor says no she belongs to me the goldsmith says i put on jewelry on her she belongs to me and the priest says well i exuded life in her she belongs to me and they are fighting and squabbling and finally the nearby villagers huddle around you know when somebody fights and people you know just for the view or for entertainment just collect so there's one old man who asked what's the matter he looked quite wise so they all explained to him in the entire story the entire episode the man thinks and says hmm well the person who created the statue and the person who exuded life into the statue are equivalent to mother and father and the person who got clothes for her is equal to the mama the uncle in our indian weddings the mama brings the myra yes and the person who brings the jewelry the necklace the rakhdi the nut the anklets and the toe rings is the person who the girl marries so by that logic the goldsmith is the true worthy groom for this girl and it was decided and that's how the story ends i hope you enjoyed the story for more don't forget to like share and subscribe this channel until we meet again ram ram